I love with all my heart Venezuela. I love with all my heart United States. And um, this Paez Medal for the Arts means a lot for me because it's a beautiful bridge of love between these two wonderful countries that are my country. Driven by an unwavering belief in the power of music to heal, unite and inspire, Gustavo Dudamel is one of the most distinguished conductors of our day. From great concert halls to classrooms, Dudamel's remarkable career of musical achievements and championing of access to the arts for young people around the world is a living example of music's extraordinary capacity to transform lives. Born in Barquisimeto, Venezuela in 1981, Dudamel has been a lifelong advocate for music education and social development through art. Dudamel's own childhood was shaped by the experience with El Sistema, the extraordinary program of immersive musical training initiated in 1975 by Maestro José Antonio Abreu. En un instante, un niño de 3, 4 años puede mostrar una intuición para el ejercicio de un arte, tal cual como el adulto más maduro. Y eso es lo que se apreció en Gustavo desde el principio. Era evidente que él estaba destinado a ser el gran conductor de este proceso. Dudamel achieved international attention by winning the inaugural Bamberger Symphoniker Gustav Mahler competition in 2004. He then went on to become the music director of the Gothenburg Symphony, where he currently holds the title Honorary Conductor. Dudamel is currently celebrating a decade as the music and artistic director of the esteemed Los Angeles Philharmonic, which the New York Times has called the best orchestra in the world. Entering his 19th year as the music director of the Simón Bolívar Symphony Orchestra, Dudamel carries on the work of his late mentor with his ongoing commitment to El Sistema in Venezuela and by supporting numerous Sistema-inspired projects around the world. Alongside his deep commitment to his two main orchestras, his career highlights include regular appearances and tours with the Berlin Philharmonic and Vienna Philharmonic, honored as the youngest ever to conduct the Vienna New Year's Day concert. Being the first classical musician to participate in the Super Bowl 50 halftime show, conducting the soundtrack for Star Wars, The Force Awakens and recording the soundtrack to Disney's holiday blockbuster, The Nutcracker. Inspired by Dudamel's early musical and mentoring experiences, the Gustavo Dudamel Foundation was created in 2012 with the goal of promoting access to music as a human right and a catalyst for learning, integration, and social change. Dudamel also continues to expand the reach of his Youth Orchestra Los Angeles initiative. The program has provided access to quality music education to tens of thousands of children from underserved communities around Los Angeles and currently serves 1,200 students a year in three venues. Gustavo Dudamel's outstanding contributions to the arts as a tireless advocate for music education, as well as his unique passion and talent for music, have earned him a place in history as one of the greatest and most influential music conductors of all time. I am very honored humble to receive the Pius Medal of the Art 2018 from the Venezuelan American Endowment for the Arts. For me, it is an inspiration, you know, to keep doing what I do with more love, more passion, and more conviction. I thank you all and all my love because this is what is music about, this is what is art about. Unite people and, you know, giving love and beauty to the people all the time. The Venezuelan American Endowment for the Arts is honored to bestow the 2018 Pais Medal of Art to Gustavo Dudamel.